After years of back and forth debate over hotels in Venice, the city is now considering several hotel proposals all at once. The latest idea is to turn the old Classics restaurant property on US 41 and Miami Avenue into a boutique hotel. ABC 7's Christopher Brantley has the details. This piece of prime real estate has sat unused since Classics restaurant closed its door last year. The sellers want to sell it to anybody. <laughs> they would like to sell the property. But the best, highest and best use of the land would really be for hotel development. Bruce Ginsburg represents the current owners who want to sell the property to a hotel developer who plans on building a four-story, high-end boutique hotel. Downtown Venice has great restaurants, entertainment, shops, everything, and a wonderful beach to boot. How could you go wrong? They might find out how they could go wrong if a future developer decides to work outside the parameters of Venice's original plan. In 1926, architect John Nolan designed Venice to be a walkable community, something the city still holds to. But there is precedent. Ninety years ago, the Brotherhood of Locomotive Engineers built three large hotels all within a couple blocks of this proposed site. Those hotels were designed under the John Nolan plan. Longtime resident Larry Humes is the past president of the Venice Heritage Society. Nolan, I think, probably knew that things would be developed, things would evolve. Humes said if a hotel was designed correctly, it could fill a void in Venice's downtown. As we do marketing surveys with visitors and we say, how could we improve your experience with Venice? One of the things they say, we'd love to have um, lodging closer in. Ginsburg and his client are hoping this idea can fix that so long as the right developer comes along. Could you picture, you know, you walk across the streets as some of the greatest restaurants and entertainment you could have. Now this could happen fast. Ginsburg says he has several developers looking at the property right now. He hopes to have something in writing within the next 30 days. In Venice, Christopher Brantley, ABC 7, your Suncoast News.